What's good YouTube, Daniel here, we're back for another episode of our Pokemon Let's Play of Pokemon Prism. So we're here in Johto in Azalea Town, we're going to face Bugsy, and then we'll make our way up to Goldenrod City and see what's occurred up there. Hi, I'm Bugsy, I never lose when it comes to bug Pokemon. You can consider me the authority on bug Pokemon. I have learned a lot over the years. Let me show you. Come on, Bugsy, then. Let's see how you've changed. Five Pokemon. Body free! Level 79. Jeez. Okay. Well. That's a bit of high level. 20. That's 21 levels higher than me. Tita, you suck. You missed. I was just pitiful. <sighs> I've switched to Typhlosion then. This should be not very effective. It still does a f like 40 damage. That's not good. Right, let's get rid of you. Here's hoping Typhlosion is actually faster than most of his bug Pokemon, unless he has a Scyther. And maybe a Yan Mega. An Almaldo. Uh, Water Rock, so for Alligator it should be alright. It's not water rock, sorry, bug, bug and rock. So, uh, let's go for a dragon dance. Oh, I'm faster anyway. Oh, that's not good. One needs 22 levels higher, 24 levels higher. Damn. I'm dead. Bye for alligator. And I know you've more than likely got a rock type move. So I hope you die from this. Oh crap. I didn't realise that sounds not very effective against a rock. Well, this is going to end badly. This is going to end very badly. If there's a sizer, I'm screwed. Yum, Mega. Uh. Level 80. Ooh, pushing, pushing boundaries. Air slash. Oh, crit. Jeez. These levels are just ridiculous. Right. Uh, wild charge. Fury cutter, that's not good. That is really not good. Come on. Are you kidding? Are you actually kidding, right? How did that not kill? I know it's not a stab or anything, but come on. Typhlosion. I need you to survive this air slash. 
Oh, for crying out loud. Yeah, whatever, Giga Drain me, or whatever. This is not good. I need Typhlosion at full health. And this is where the red line and one Pokemon comes up comes up pain. Withdrew. There's Fortress. Hmm. Put you to sleep even though it ain't gonna do much. <sighs> this is gonna do nothing. Pitiful damage. This reminds me of I should have done a lava pull at first with the Typhlosion. I'd probably still have a much better chance. Well, there's a toxic. I'll, I'll double each turn. Roll out. What you can do with roll out? By fortress. Well done, Gallade. Out comes Yam Mega, Typhlosion can come out. Holy, that did way too much. <coughs> 142 damage. And Sizor. Level 84. I'm not even anywhere close. That's a crit. I don't know if I'm going to be faster, that's the problem. Right, I can survive, so that's fine. Flame thrower. I know, I'm, I know base stat-wise I'm faster, but... We've been 22 levels higher, you don't really know. Trying to find wild charge, no thank you. I'm good. I already have a wild charge user. You are amazing. There will always be something new to learn about book Pokemon. Please take the hype badge. And please take this gift as well, you deserve it. TM87. This book TM works for all Pokemon with heart. That way, even more Pokemon can harness the power of bug. So it's just basically giving me mega harm then. Yes, he has. Yes, my Glade is dying slowly. Let's heal up and let's head up to Goldenrod and see what's occurred there. Right. So into Ilex Forest and we'll use a Max Petal just so we don't have to mess around with any encounters. 
one. Let's go check around the old places, see if there's anything missing. Probably not. Ooh, item. A green flute. Very nice. So that's just the usual area where you catch your far fetch. The shrine. Uh, or is that guy still around here? Is it? No. Found two PP ups. This guy who gives you headbutt's not around. Fair enough. So, Route 34. Ah, we've still got the trainers. Keep on training, yeah, yeah. Pokemon fan Brendan. Raichu! Level 80. Jesus Christ. Ho <coughs> <coughs> oh, ho, almost. Almost one, one KO in a Raichu. See, 2091. For a Pokemon that was 22 levels higher. It's like, where is the balance? <coughs> There's just no balance whatsoever. Alright, what we got? Breloom, well I'm switching. I'm, four I'm weak to both your typings. So I ain't staying in. See, bomb. Wow. Did a fair amount of damage. Breloom's a good Pokemon as well. A second Breloom? Don't be one of those with three of the same Pokemon. You probably are as well, aren't you? Mac Punch! Good that you still got that. That's like the first move it learns when it evolves from a Shroomish. And the Venusaur to finish. Uh, come on, Galileo. Let's see if you can do something. Level 77. Jeez. It's 23 levels higher. Sunny day. Instant solar beam. Probably got thick fat as well. There's a solar beam. So I like coming a mile away. The sunlight is strong, I know. Instant flamethrower death. Overgrow, you have nothing. So you can't go into the daycare then. For sale. Looks like nobody lives here. Ah. That's that's terrible, isn't it? The daycare people moved. Shame. Youngster Samuel. Can I buy it? I want to buy the, uh, the old uh, daycare area. Rapidash. Charm. Wow. Level 
Well, you'll live completely. <coughs> Jam again. Jeez. That's four stages. Save 3,126. Uh, even though this is probably a bad idea. Well, it's not a bad idea, it's just terrible because of minus four attack. <laughs> Got a pitiful rock slide. How pitiful that was. Well, at least he'll die anyway. Brave Bird! See, all the recall damage. You're destined to die. And a swallow, I'm just gonna change. Go on, looks right. Swallow! Swallow's not a bad Pokemon, actually. I did so much. And so max that a recall damage can do in return is only half health. Right, so we're hearing Goldenrod. Underground entrance. So it changed it up a little bit. Game corner. Oh, for goodness sake. Still got that. <sighs> that NPC that always walks in front of you. So you can't get to the counter. Do, 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 do. Right, let's have a look around. This Oh, look at that poor guy there. I remember when Team Rocket tried to take over the town. A child named Gold saved everybody. I'm very good at judging how happy Topper now with their trainers. Okay, uh... Evaluate my Tyranitar. Oh, your Tyranitar it really seems to love you. I think it can use Dragon Pulse with great ease. Would you like me to teach the move Dragon Pulse to Tyranitar? No. Huh. Uh, let's see what moves everyone can learn then. The Typhlosion where it to use Faint Attack with ease. Wow. No. Glalie. Perish song, nope. Why are you giving me useless moves? Extreme speed, that won't be too bad I guess, but my move set's good. Sweet kiss, that's just no. Just no with that. And about for alligator focus engine. Nope. What boring moves. Your Pokemon won't be happy if it faints during battle. Oh, too bad. They faint all the time. If your Pokemon is happy enough, a one will teach a special move. Most Pokemon will be able to learn that move from leveling up or even TMs. Yeah, but it's the crap moves. The Magnet Train. The Golden Rod Cape. It was sad when the department store was destroyed. However, they're building a new one. 
The basement should be fine, but nobody has been down there in years. Ah, uh, is that true? The underground entrance. The gym is here. <coughs> I'm sorry, I can't allow you to pass unless you're a Joko citizen. We had to crack down on security because rumour has it that a criminal from a faraway region is hiding out here. Ah, is that true? I'm so proud of my son. Aww. My brother Bill made the PC Pokemon storage system. Good to know. So let's go for uh, badge number two. So it looks like this is going to be just a simple straight walk up and just destroy Whitney. With their normal types, which will do nothing to my Tita. So Tita should do alright. Hoping, anyway, at least. Oh. You have reversal. But it doesn't do much at full health. And that was just terrible damage. I hate reversal so much. Why did I send out a nice type? I have a death wish. That was stupid. I was, I was like, the fame, because that was just a stupid move. That was just terrible XP. Wigglytuff. I think it's normal sound or fairy sound. Oof. Whichever, but. Ah, for crap. Freaking cute charm. Apparently, I was super effective against the psychic type. Yeah, you're part fairy still. You're fairy sound. You're fairy sound. You must. How do you get a gas type move and do that much damage? That is ridiculous. How does a fairy sound pop and have mustard gas? Please kill it, look for it. Please. Well done. Alright. Well, looks like we have to go back in here. So, we're going to be running back and forth. Well, if we don't get a chance to beat Whitney in today's episode, at least we can f uh, just be at the point where we can fight her in the next episode. And then we can go investigate uh, Golden Rug Cape as well. So let's, Matt, let's go see how many more trainers you've got left, Whitney. So another one. 
Yep, so that's Whitney there. That. Oh, for goodness sake, a Wigglytuff again. Go to sleep. That's how long you'll sleep for. That's if you get affected by cute charm. Woke up. First turn. That is just, oh for goodness sake, the burn. That is just ridiculous. Let's see if this is gonna burn. very effective against a nice type. And there's the burn. Would mustard gas always burn? I understand why it would, but... So that's the whole point of mustard gas. So it's not fairer than it's normal sound. Looks if it's fair, unless sound is not weak, unless sound resists steel. Well, it would make sense. Super effective against it, as I forgot. <coughs> hey, Lapani. Flail. I'll do nothing. Say what? Double kick. Enjoy. Okay. That's fine. Double kick. See what you do. So it would have actually killed as well. And obviously Q Champ. That looks right. What did you get and get away with play using play with the punter? You're not a fairy type. Stop trying to cheat. Well, there's Whitney. So we'll leave it there and uh, by ta by when we start next episode I'll have healed up and hopefully prepared for Whitney and uh, probably cat prepare for her. So if you have enjoyed today's episode, don't forget to leave a like. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit, hit that subscribe button as well. If you've missed out on any of the episodes, check the link in the description below. I've been Dan with Spring Gaming, and see you next time.